Welcome to Briefish Conspiracy. If you are new to my channel, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. It really helps us out. Utah monolith. Do you know, I, I put a little video on this about yesterday. And you know, one of the first comments I got, it's not a monolith. I was like, all right, smart ass. Technically, a monolith is a stone structure, this shape. And this thing's obviously made out of metal. So it was your first instinct when you saw this. Oh, I'll tell you what, by the way, I've been so looking forward to this. I'm going to crack open a beer. Why not? <laughs> you got a cup of tea. <laughs> Cheers, sir. Cheers. Yeah, so go on. What was your first instinct? Uh, my first instinct was, was set up. Right? Yeah. Um, just, just the way that the... Uh, I mean, that video doesn't help with the... Uh, the yeah. It would help if the uniforms or the flight suits they were wearing fit. Have you noticed that? They're all really baggy, like they've like they've just dragged them out. Yeah, exactly. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't look good. No. Um, I've seen better sets on in Star Trek from the 60s. Yeah. Know, to be honest. It's a pretty solid, if it is, if this is fake, and a lot, I, I have to admit, I asked, when I put my little video out yesterday, I asked opinions, and a lot of people just came back and went, fake. And I said, a fake or art project. Mm. But my answer to that is, why did you why did they put it there the only way it, i think it's fake or an art project is if that flight crew were in on it and they they found it on purpose or somebody's gone out into the middle of nowhere built that thing in a canyon where you could just walk right past it and not see it that could have been undiscovered for years yeah many years well they the um google earth reckons it was uh, between 2015 and 2016. Yeah. But, but there's um, the uh, Agency of Pu Public Safety in America says mm -hmm. that it could have been there for 40 to 50 years. Um, really? Yeah. Um, I, I saw on a video on Facebook as well that uh, hundreds and hundreds of people have just piled there. I bet they have. Hundreds. Uh, well, that's why initially they said they weren't going to release where it was, weren't they? And I know there's yeah. been a dis bit of disagreement. There's two locations, apparently, they've been talking about. Right. Uh, one that we've seen on Google Earth, and there's this other story I'll tell you about in a minute, which is miles away in Snow Canyon. Oh, right. That, um, yeah. that, uh, I'll, I'll tell you why immediately when I, read, I watched that DVD, or I watched that YouTube video, sorry, I went. <laughs> but um, hey, we'll talk about that in a minute. Yeah. Um, and tell, the... Uh, just really quickly, the, um, the guys that were doing video when there was loads of people um, mm. going right up to it, and there's gaps, there's like millimetre gaps in between each, you know, three sheets, and it's yeah. been pivoted, so it's not alien at all, and it's been concreted mm. in, you know what I mean? Concreted um, in, okay. Yeah. So, you know, Take some samples of the concrete, see how old the concrete is. You know, it's not going to be mm. 60 years old. It, it's, it's an elaborate hoax, isn't it? No. I mean, if it's stainless steel, it could have been there a while. But, well, I, I say elaborate hoax. I think there are other reasons why it could be there that's beyond a hoax. I, I do think it could be an art project. It could be something that's supposed to get this, be, that, that, that somebody knew there would this be this hoopla. Uh, yeah. And... My first instinct was, oh, for God's sake, 2020, will you just leave us alone? <laughs> just, it's like, come on. Yeah, um, easing us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come on, mate. We've had enough of that now. Um, some of the some of the stuff I've had, though, some of the um, theories <clears throat> has been um, that we're all living in a simulation in the Matrix, mm -hmm. um, and all over the planet there are these points, um, and they're like control rods. So that was one theory. <laughs> Uh, the other theory was that it's a massive metal dinosaur, and that's his penis. <laughs> I quite like that one. I think they might have been joking, but um, yeah. <laughs> if they dig down, there's Metal Godzilla. <laughs> That'd be awesome. <laughs> I quite like that one. Um, uh, have you said there's a picture of the motor of Facebook, and there's a woman on a on, holding onto a, a tree on a stump of a tree? Oh. And then it pans up and it's Groot going, I am Groot. <laughs> like she's hanging <laughs> off his... Anyway. Um, uh, yeah, so I mean, I've had a, a few other ones. The, I like that one. Um, the other one I was doing, it, it is, there is an alien spaceship under there. They just have to dig it up. Mm -hmm. There isn't. Um, and oh, that it's a marker. 
I really wish yeah. it, it was a, a lot better than, you know, yeah. it turned out to be. It looks uh, great from a distance, so doesn't it? Yeah, it does. From a distance, it looks stunning. I want to go there and camp. <laughs> and, and, you know, and just like camp overnight under that thing. I think it would just be a glorious place to spend the night, you know. Um, but, yeah, I, I can understand why why people are there. Um, one of the things that this has obviously then sparked off is all the monoliths that are around the world. Yeah. But also, apparently there's one on Mars that, yeah. um, that NASA just said to boulder calm down. But it looks like a monolith in the photos. There's one on Phobos, which is a very unusual one of Mars's moons. And, and apparently there's one on the moon as well. Our moon. There's, there's, I've, I've yeah. found on that as well. All oh, right. Yeah. It's the one that I found. It, it looks like a monolith. It probably isn't. It does, it. But, oh, well, it might be, but it might be a natural rock formation. It still might be natural, but it still it, might be a monolith. It does look uh, a bit weird. Though. Yeah. I mean, I was, whenever I think about that, when everybody says, oh, look at this rock, doesn't it look like something? I always go, yeah, have you been to um, the Devil's Causeway in Northern Ireland? That looks crazy. Yeah. And that's a perfectly natural formation. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, sometimes. Mm. But, um, so, yeah, so are we going to go then with man-made? Yeah. And potentially, <laughs> not even very well man-made. <laughs> not even very well man-made, no. no. Yeah. Um, and I don't think it would have been that hard to put up either. And I think they probably could have put it up where it was, particularly oh, sure. if it is riveted. Not, um, yeah. I wondered why it might, it might have been weld points because I couldn't see it very well in the initial video. Mm. Um, but if it's riveted, then that's even easier. So that's probably then a wooden frame and just metal sheeting riveted attached onto it or whatever then. Yeah, yeah, possibly. Yeah. yeah. That would be the easiest way of doing it. It could be a metal frame, but then it's more expensive again and heavier. Um, but in that case, you could just go out in a bloody um, on a, on a, on a pickup truck and probably do that in an afternoon. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. yeah. So um, I, I think if it, if it has been there five years, so that could have been accidentally discovered by that air crew. The air crew could. If it's, yeah. if, if it's a hoax or whatever, the air crew must have been in on it. Yeah. Or why um, would you leave it there to be accidentally found? Yeah. You know exactly. what I mean? Yeah. But to make the story up that we're talking about, I guess. But. Um, I, I was reading some of the comments on um, the guys in the helicopter, uh, mm. and a lot, like, like most of the comments, um, mm. saying that you can tell that they're in on it by the way their voices are and, and how they're talking. Um, mm. I've, I've not seen, I must admit, the only video that I've seen of it is your video. I've not seen All any right. other video, um, just, just because. Um, but uh, yeah, I'll go back and I'll have a look at some other videos. But yeah, I have heard people saying they they sound it sounds very. But I, I mean, I think that's 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 not the thing. They found that, and, and I think in their opinion, they, it could have just as easily been they found something weird. All I was thinking was, if it's a hoax, why would you just leave it there and risk that it might not be found? Um, but maybe they did because, yeah. like you said, this thing is looks like it might have been there since 2015. Yeah. So in that case, they might have built it and just left it. I got another theory though. I do have a theory. I was wondering if it's been built as like a meeting point. Um, I could see um, either like alien, you know, an alien group, which they're, they're all over the world, and uh, you know, maybe trying to do this um, close encounters of the fifth kind thing, you know, like psychic link that Stephen Greer's made so popular. Maybe yeah. it's like, like basically a meeting point in the out in the desert, and they gather around it or they think it'll be a focal point of the energy or something or or i could see like spiritualists or something mm. thinking yeah. it was a, you know so somebody might have lost their um their group hut sort of thing their meeting point <laughs> it's like oh that was ours yeah it, it'd be nice to see to see what's under the ground though definitely if there's a cave system yeah. or anything like that just for the first I, I was there but yeah it is hidden away though isn't it as well you, you yeah know, it's not on display, exactly. It? If you look at the images as well for the um, the 2015 and the 2016 image where the obelisk appears, in the 2015 image there's quite a lot of bush, and there's quite a few bushes and things on the on the floor, which seem to have then been cleared away for, for right. the more modern image, the 2016 image, which again makes it look like people have actually gone in and sort of cleared the space for some yeah. reason, which again makes me think, is it some point. sort of meeting point for for a local UFO group or? Mm. Um, one of the theories that's gone out there, 
oh, the, 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 the YouTube channels, they immediately go out there to get, right. I, I try to have a little bit of integrity on my channel. Now, I'm not saying I won't ever put up a interesting title to try and get views yeah. um, or, you know, try and click bake a little bit. But I would never put the, the title to this video will not be monolith thing, truth. It won't be. It'll be that we are discussing it. Um, MMS TV have had a whistleblower, a couple of um, emails um, that this is Scientology linked. Um, oh, and this, yeah, this bloke has emailed them a couple of times. Yeah. He was on about how he paid five guys a hundred dollars each to help him build it and then take it out there. That included that increase to fifteen guys in his second email. But mm. yeah, maybe fifteen, one or five. He just forgot to the one. Maybe I don't know. <laughs> um, but he says he was. It was basically commissioned by somebody with Scientology. Um, right. He says the reason why he was so scared and he was anonymous in his email was because he was scared because it, the Scientologists aren't very nice people. And they're, they're like the cult mafia, aren't they? I think um, I'm probably going to uh, get somebody knocking on my door for saying that. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. He then goes on about how he's got to get to work so he can't fight anymore. And then he writes another email and it's he owes them another hundred dollars for paying up and they're out to get him. Oh, it went on a bit. Um, I'll share it. Um, oh. But oh man, it's just nonsense. But they've then they've then released this YouTube video. Like, well, there you go then. I Proof. <laughs> and it's not. <laughs> um, another theory, which is, have you seen Third Phase of the Moon? Yeah, it's another channel I'm on about. Um, they they come up with some hundred percent. This is hundred percent proof, and it's not. They have another eyewitness. Now he says aliens, and um and. Or, or military experiment, to, to be fair. And I've actually had people share this with me um, and, and, and tell me that um, this is fact like it isn't. And, and, and my comments, I couldn't understand where these comments were coming from. And then I found this video and I'm like, oh, this has come from there. Um, so the story goes, residents in the area on Friday night saw it dropping in from the sky. Um, it was described as like um, a controlled fall. Right. In the video, they talk about, you know, Elon Musk's um, re-entry rockets where they just come down like that sort of thing um he said it looked like that there was a bright light friday night there was a glowing over the hilltop for a few hours afterwards they sent search and rescue teams out and he knows this has happened because one of the family one of his family members was on the search and rescue team and they found the object and the monolisk they put a chain around it and tried to rip it out of the ground with their truck and couldn't they couldn't even move it right really yeah apparently yeah. It was incredibly cold to the touch when they found it. And just after that, um, the military turned up, basically. Um, he has said that they're quite a small community and they know the people that work in this department, This um, the, these people that do these, uh, you know, the, the helicopter crew, basically. They, he'd never seen any of these people before, didn't know who they were. So he thinks that's a smoke screen um, just to sort of throw us off the track. Which, to be fair, it might be anyway, but that's not the point. Um, and there's now military teams have gone in and they've closed the whole area off. There's like seven mile radius around it. And now they've put out this other place up the road with, a, with you know, the monolith thing to distract people from. Because this has all happened in Snow Canyon, right. uh, which is in the Zion National Park, which is not far from Area 51. He's only about 15, 20 miles from Area 51. Um, so he says, we see strange things all the time. This wasn't really a thing. We know where to keep our mouths shut. So the, the first thing he did was phone third phase of the moon. He <laughs> said he was anonymous, but then he let them use his face. <laughs> so we see him. <laughs> but then again, phase moon of the sun, third moon's phase, third phase of the moon yeah. have released this like, it's fact. And aren't we clever? We've we we've got the information out first and i'll probably get a thousand subscribers from it i'll tell you what though third phase of moon i um you know they're an all right channel but the comments on on the last couple of videos the last couple of weeks yeah unbelievable so much hate towards uh third phase of moon unbelievable well i think it's because they just talk well in this in this case they've just made up a load of nonsense 
um, uh, whoever this guy was he interviewed was either just one of their subscribers that thought they'd get in on the act, or yeah. I, I don't want to say they um, they it. set it up. Yeah. This isn't like Secure Team Ten when he was caught um, faking some of his own evidence and things. I think it's it's so I wouldn't want to say that, but what I'm I will say is, <laughs> yeah, I loved it back in the day, didn't you? We all did. Um, but I, I would say at very least, they've been very quick to believe this guy and they're putting it out like it's fact where they could have gone. We don't know who this person is. We're putting a story out there because it's interesting, but take it with a pinch of salt. But they didn't. They went yeah, explained, yeah. done, move on. Um, it's, uh, it's a great story, though. Have you seen the snakehead? The what? Do you know what I mean? The snakehead. Have you seen that? No. I'll have a look in the images. I'll send you the picture in a minute. Um, And there's a snakehead in the background. A massive rock snakehead. Now, as soon as you see it, you can't unsee it. It's not the turtle, is it? Maybe a turtle head then. I think it looks like a snake. Some people are saying, I've heard people are saying, oh, there's a massive turtle's head in the background. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Squeezing one out. Quite possibly. <laughs> Maybe it's it's that's it's it's got a metal wang. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but uh, oh, fantastic. Oh, I've got no drink. Yeah, but there's so many, so many brilliant stories. But I think this is going to come down to it's either a hoax and the helicopter crew were in on it, mm-hmm. um, or um, it is an art project that was just left there. Well, my personal thing is, I, I reckon it's some sort of meeting point for people, but I've got no way of proving that's, that. But it wouldn't surprise a, me if it came out. Yeah, that's a really good uh, theory, that. It really is. Meeting. I come up with them occasionally. That's my mm-hmm. 2020 theory. I'm I not think, having any more this year. <laughs> I think that we can discount um, uh, the person you are just talking about. Um, we did the interview with uh, Third Phase. Third Phase of the Moon, yeah. It was yeah, I can just sort of like take my notes on that one and go, oh, yeah, bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't happen. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's a strange one, isn't it? It really is. Um, first thing that I'd do would, would be um, date the, uh, the cement. Mm. I'd do date the cement. Um, just have a look around the area, see what's there. Like yeah. Google images, have a little look, do a bit of research, but yeah, you know, you can see the way it's developed. Yeah. That, I mean, that's, that's, okay. we know it's man-made, it's definitely man-made, right? it's not alien. It's interesting, I like the mystery, I'd like to know where it came from, but I'm not desperate to find out. Um, it's like, okay, um, it's another good 2020 story, and... Um, and, and, and yeah, it stopped me thinking about COVID for 24 hours. That was nice. <laughs> uh, I had something else to think about. 